two by two. The earth filled up with people, but they sinned so much that God was sorry He had made them. He decided to send a flood to wash away everyone on earth. <laughs> <laughs> there was a man named Noah who wasn't like the others. Noah loved God and obeyed Him. God decided to spare Noah and his family from the flood. God warned Noah about the flood. He told him to build an enormous boat with a low roof, three decks, a window, and a door. In obedience, Noah built it. loved and obeyed God. God told Noah to collect two of every kind of animal, one male, one female. Then Noah, his family, and the animals went into the boat. God shut the door. It rained for 40 days and 40 nights. Water fell from the sky and rose from the oceans and lakes. Even the tallest mountains disappeared beneath the flood. <laughs> Did God tell Noah to take one of each kind of animal onto the ark? Meanwhile, Noah, his family, and all the animals were safe in the boat, floating on the floodwaters. God had not forgotten about Noah, not even for a moment. God sent a wind to blow. The waters went down. The boat rested on Mount Ararat. Noah sent out a dove. When it didn't return, he knew it was safe. <laughs> when the ground was dry, God told them to come out. He put a rainbow in the sky as a promise that he would never flood the whole earth again. <laughs> God put a rainbow in the sky as a promise that he would never flood the whole earth again. True or false? <laughs> 